What's going on guys, Vulcan here, and today we had a surprise video drop, The Legends of New World Chapter 3, which is the final installment of the series. Now this video goes through some backstory for New World, very interesting, um, nice little lore tidbits, but there are some very cool Easter eggs hidden in this video. Some cool weapon combinations, the confirmation of a couple other new weapons coming to the game, as well as a little bit of interpretation on one particular scene. So there's a lot, it goes by very quick. And if you don't pause and kind of have eagle eyes, then you might miss it. So let's go ahead and watch this video. I'll pause it when we need to, and we'll talk about some of the things that we're seeing. So a little bit earlier in the video, we saw the individual have like a tome and he was pulling kind of like a life force out of it. Here we see almost that exact same thing. So we see this character has a tome here in their main, main hand or off hand. It's a syndicate, uh, obviously a player here, but they're creating this almost like a life force or this shield to block this corruption attack. Now, to my knowledge, we don't have any magic shields that we can use. We don't also, we also don't have any tome weapons. Maybe this is a call out to a future weapon being added. I'm not entirely sure, but being able to see kind of this like mirror force style ability was pretty cool. And I know magic casters are gonna love this type of stuff. So let's go ahead and keep this thing moving. Okay, so do you see it? So over here on the right-hand side, we have an individual wielding a hatchet and a shield. So this has been one of the highest requested weapon combinations that I've seen out there from players. Why can't we take our one-handed hatchet that we have already and wield it with a shield? and make almost like a battle maiden or a berserker kind of character. This would be really, really cool to see. Now, next to this individual, we see this person here. So there's a couple ways you can interpret this. One, you can pull that this is a fire staff. Obviously, there's like an orange glow to it. Or you can pull that it does kind of look a little bit like a two-handed mace, but we'll have to wait and see. For me, I'm leaning a little bit more towards fire staff, but I've been kind of going back and forth with a few of friends of mine, and they're like, oh, it looks like a two-handed mace. So um, jury's still out, but to me, fire staff. But we also have another individual back here, very blurred out, but it looks like they are wielding that two-handed claymore that we've seen data mined, that we know is coming at some point in time, but this is just another confirmation. I believe this one was also in the last chapter of Legends of New World. And then on the far left, we have this individual here who doesn't appear to have anything, but they're very blurred out. So we don't really know what they're wielding. It could be that they have their dual daggers type of approach. Maybe that's what they're having. Maybe they just don't have anything. So jury's still out, but it seems kind of strange that they're not holding anything, yet everybody else seems to be holding something. And all the other characters, they all have kind of the regular weapons that we know and have seen for quite some time. So the rest of this trailer plays through and there really isn't anything um, significant to call out, but I wanna hear from you guys. Would you like to see a hatchet and shield combo or would you rather have dual wielding hatchets for a true berserker style gameplay? And then how many people would actually roll with a claymore? Is that something you're really looking forward to? I wanna hear from you, so let's talk about it in the comment section below. And as always, this has been Vulcan and I'll talk to you guys next time.